Police have arrested two people accused of murdering an infant child in Lawrence. Officers picked up the pair last night in Tennessee, more than two months after the young child died. RTV6 reporter Chance Walser joins us live outside the Marion County Jail tonight with why prosecutors say this case is so disturbing. Chance? Prosecutors say the child was abused. When doctors assessed little Ava McGee, they found fresh bruises as well as broken ribs and other old injuries that hadn't quite healed yet. According to court documents, the abuse occurred in late September when 18 year old Corey Bullock was babysitting his girlfriend's child, that's Ava. The baby's mother, 22 year old April Hammer, came home from work to find bruising on the child's head. Bullock allegedly told her Ava hit her head in a crib. For three days, the bruising got worse and the child's condition deteriorated. Eventually, Bullock's mom called 911. Doctors say the child's injuries were extensive and consistent with child abuse. What the doctors have told us is that banging your head on a crib is not going to cause the type of injuries that this child sustained. Otherwise, every child would have some kind of injury of this nature just from walking or toddling or pulling up on things. And that's just not... It's not the biological process. In the days following the child's death, both Bullock and Hammer were available for police interviews, but the two eventually traveled to Tennessee as these murder charges were being filed. Tennessee police arrested the two. They're now being extradited back to Indiana to face these charges. Hammer is also charged in a separate case where she is accused of beating and strangling a pregnant woman. A court date for her has not been set quite yet. Live downtown, Chance Walser, RTV6. All new